Time Division Synchronous Code Division Multiple Access or UTRA TDD 1.28M CPS Low Chip Rate is an air interface found in UMTS mobile telecommunications networks in China as an alternative to WCDMA. The term TDSCDMA is misleading. While it suggests covering only a channel access method, it is actually the common name for the whole air interface specification. Together with TDCDMA, it is one of the two time division duplex UMTS air interfaces, known commonly as UMTS TDD or more formally as IMT2000 CDMA TDD or IMT2000 time division. Both air interfaces use a combination of two channel access methods, code division multiple access and time division multiple access. The frequency band is divided into time slots, which are further divided into channels using CDMA spreading codes. These air interfaces are classified as a TDD, because time slots can be allocated to either uplink or downlink traffic. Objectives TDS-CDMA was developed in the People's Republic of China by the Chinese Academy of Telecommunications Technology, Daytang Telecom, and Siemens AG in an attempt to avoid dependence on Western technology. This is likely primarily for practical reasons since other 3G formats require the payment of patent fees to a large number of Western patent holders. TDS-CDMA proponents also claim it is better suited for densely populated areas. Further, it is supposed to cover all usage scenarios, whereas WCDMA is optimized for symmetric traffic and macro cells, while TDC-DMA is best used in low mobility scenarios within micro or pico cells. TDSCDMA is based on spread spectrum technology which makes it unlikely that it will be able to completely escape the payment of license fees to Western patent holders. The launch of a national TDSCDMA network was initially projected by 2005 but only reached large-scale commercial trials with 60,000 users across eight cities in 2008. On January 7, 2009, China granted a TDS-CDMA 3G license to China Mobile. On September 21, 2009, China Mobile officially announced that it had 1,327,000 TDS-CDMA subscribers as of the end of August, 2009. While TD is primarily a China-only system, it may well be exported to developing countries. It is likely to be replaced with a newer TDLTE system over the next five years. Deployment and Usage On January 20, 2006, Ministry of Information Industry of the People's Republic of China formally announced that TDSCDMA is the country's standard of 3G mobile telecommunication. On February 15, 2006, a timeline for deployment of the network in China was announced, stating pre commercial trials would take place starting after completion of a number of test networks in select cities. These trials ran from March to October, 2006, but the results were apparently unsatisfactory. In early 2007, the Chinese government instructed the dominant cellular carrier, China Mobile, to build commercial trial networks in eight cities, and the two fixed-line carriers, China Telecom and China Netcom, to build one each in two other cities. Construction of these trial networks was scheduled to finish during the fourth quarter of 2007, but delays meant that construction was not complete until early 2008. The standard has been adopted by 3GPP since RHEL 4, known as UTRA TDD 1.28 Mbps option. On March 28, 2008, China Mobile Group announced TDSCDMA commercial trials for 60,000 test users in eight cities from April 1, 2008. Networks using other 3G standards had still not been launched in China, as these were delayed until TDSCDMA was ready for commercial launch. In January 2009 the Ministry of Industry and Information Technology in China took the unusual step of assigning licenses for three different third-generation mobile phone standards to three carriers in a long-awaited step that is expected to prompt $41 billion in spending on new equipment. The Chinese-developed standard, TDSCDMA, was assigned to China Mobile, the world's biggest phone carrier by subscribers. That appeared to be an effort to make sure the new system has the financial and technical backing to succeed. 
licenses for two existing 3G standards, WCDMA and CDMA 2001 XEV2, were assigned to China Unicom and China Telecom, respectively. Third generation, or 3G, technology supports web surfing, wireless video and other services and the start of services expected to spur new revenue growth. Currently in China, China Mobile have access to the following frequency band for TDS CDMA deployment. Technical highlights, TDS CDMA uses TDD, in contrast to the FDD scheme used by WCDMA. By dynamically adjusting the number of time slots used for downlink and uplink, the system can more easily accommodate asymmetric traffic with different data rate requirements on downlink and uplink than FDD schemes. Since it does not require paired spectrum for downlink and uplink, spectrum allocation flexibility is also increased. Using the same carrier frequency for uplink and downlink also means that the channel condition is the same on both directions, and the base station can deduce the downlink channel information from uplink channel estimates, which is helpful to the application of beamforming techniques. TDS CDMA also uses TDMA in addition to the CDMA used in WCDMA. This reduces the number of users in each time slot, which reduces the implementation complexity of multi user detection and beamforming schemes, but the non continuous transmission also reduces coverage, mobility, and complicates radio resource management algorithms. The S in TDS CDMA stands for synchronous which means that uplink signals are synchronized to the base station receiver, achieved by continuous timing adjustments. This reduces the interference between users of the same time slot using different codes by improving the orthogonality between the codes, therefore increasing system capacity, at the cost of some hardware complexity in achieving uplink synchronization. See also, WCDMA, TDCDMA, Dynamic TDMA, Telecommunications Industry in China, Communications in China, Standardization in China. References Documentation, TS 25.201 Physical Layer A Euro General Description A Euro describes basic differences between FDD and TDD. TS 25.221 Physical Channels and Mapping of the Transport Channels onto Physical Channels, TS 25.222 Multiplexing and Channel Coding, TS 25.223 Spreading and Modulation, TS 25.224 Physical Layer Procedures, TS 25.225 Physical Layer Euro Measurements. External links, TDS CDMA Forum, TDS CDMA Industry Alliance, China will not interfere in 3G standard selection, China will provide 3G service in cities where Olympic Games 2008 are held.